It has been too, too long since I have visited the Lakeland Antique Mall. This location is about an hour drive, give or take, from the theme parks. Now, sometimes you can make it here in about 45 minutes, but I will tell you, make sure that you don't head out around rush hour traffic because this is a very well-used road in order to get this to this location and it could take you two hours to get here if you started at a bad time. Why do I love this place so much? One, it's huge. It has tons of vintage and antique collectibles, but as a Disney fanatic, they have an amazing amount of Disney props, universal theme props here at this location, and it's just been way too long. So today I'm gonna to be focusing on, focusing. So today I will be focusing on the Disney merchandise. I will be open up for shop to shop here. I should be coming back here within two weeks. If you see anything, you can definitely send me an email at shoppingwithcharacter at gmail.com. Now, because for me, it's about a three hour round trip to get down here, my shopping fee will be 25% of the entire sale. So for now, let's check out what they have in stock. If you're curious about the hours, they are open 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. unless it's Sunday, then they close at six. So when you first walk in, this place is humongous. Now there is a Disney March spread across the entire place. However, I'm gonna go follow this sign F all the way to the very back. So I haven't even made it all the way back and I've hit so much Disney stuff. But I'm going to make a quick left over here and this is where I want to show how far down you will go in order to locate all of the Disney Resort props. And it starts, okay, so I believe this, it starts here, their booth that they own like half of this backside of the store. Oh my gosh, I'm already freaking out. Okay, I have not looked at anything, so you are going to experience the same goodness as me. Okay, I'm gonna try these little cups here. Two bucks, little Toy Story cups. Oh my gosh, they're so, oh my gosh. I can't even, I can make a five million hour video here. I need to open up for some live shopping in my Facebook group. If you agree, comment down below. How, how fun would that be? Oh my gosh, there's so much. Where do I look? I don't even know where to look. Oh, look at the lamp. Oh, how cute is a lamp? Why am I whispering? I don't know. Oh my goodness, how much is the lamp? I don't know, there's no price on it. Don't go on it. Oh, there it is. Ooh. Let me not touch the lamp. Two eighty nine. Okay, you can stay right there. Oh, but look, they've got the oh, the rolling desk is forty five, and then the top desk is one forty five. They've got Dumbo slippers, nineteen ninety nine. What a great deal! Five dollars for the Wreck It Ralph ice cream trophy cup. Oh, what is this down here? Oh, a Tangled zipper. These are brand new. So some of their items they have are brand new and some are uh, used or of course coming from the actual resorts. They've got this Disney Glow Mickey head. Let me zoom in on this. Is this like an antenna topper? Because it glows. Hmm. I don't know where this was from. Ooh, the rare Finding Dory Glow Clue. Glow Cube. I cannot talk. I definitely need some coffee, you guys. Glow Cube. I'm so excited. I'm just like, <laughs> just like Dory. $2.99. And then the Disney Mickey Topper, where dreams come true. That is $5.99. This came from Star Wars Galaxy Edge. It's a like a jug sipper. These are $15.99. We have some Disney Grand Floridian chairs from their suites at $1.30. But look how cute that they did this section over here. It's all Madame Leota stuff. Haunted Mansion. Oh my goodness. 
some of these things are newer. That's actually, look at this, $40. I think this was originally $40. And did this go through the outlets? Because I don't remember them going through the outlets. Wow. Oh, I love this mug for only $18.99. <gasps> I'm so tempted to get this. I don't, I don't recall even seeing this mug. This is so cool. <gasps> Shut up. This is not for sale, but this is the actual cabinet from Memento Mori. That's so cool. Oh, hi. <laughs> that is so cool. What is this? Oh my goodness. $46.99 Haunted Mansion Scroll Map. It's embroidered. Oh my gosh. They just have so much. I don't know like what to look at. $14.99. Is it a set for $14.99 or each one? This one has a little chip on it. But they're so cute. And look at them. They're like, hey, we know you're cute. This is probably most definitely one of my favorite finds so far. And I like that they have a large stock of this. It's only $9.99. And you could frame this and use this as a print. Mickey and Pals get the scoop. So it's some type of promo thing that they had going on. I don't recall this at all. I don't know any information about this. If you know, let me know. But for 10 bucks, that is a steal. Oh so they have some of the Grand Floridian Mad Hatter art from the room. $59.99. And they have, let's see, I think two different styles. They have this one here, already framed, ready to be hung on your wall. Could touch up the frame a little bit if you wanted to but i don't know i don't i don't i wouldn't personally <sighs> i am a sucker for art and i am a sucker for all things polynesian resort 379 dollars and 99 cents oh it's so pretty you know which art piece that i really would love is the inside the dvc rooms inside the bathroom they have a print well actually painting i was a painting or a print <laughs> of uh mermaids and i love it it's so colorful oh what is this this looks cool over here 95 dollars from wilderness lodge headboard art oh that's cool so i guess that was part of the headboard and you could hang it up as art oh i like it i like it this is from the grand floridian christmas display in the lobby area and that's $45. They also have quite a bit of the resort pillows. I swear every time I come through here I pick up a couple <laughs> because they're so cute. This one's from Polynesian. Was it? No, I thought it was from Polynesian. I'm mistaken. This one is from Wilderness Lodge. This one is from Saratoga Springs Hidden Mickey. These are $24.99 a piece. I also like how this booth puts pictures of where some of these things were located this is a gorgeous pillow look at it this one was from wilderness lodge it's a thumper pillow it's quite large and this one's a little bit more probably because it's a little bit more rare this is the only one i see right now that they have in stock and this one is 69.99 they even have curtains this one is from the boardwalk you're fifty dollars. Boy, you can't you can't even get new curtains for that price. I feel like. Ooh, is this Polynesian? It is. Oh my god, I want this. I'm not gonna lie. I really want this. I wonder. Ooh. Oh, it's a shower curtain. No. Now I really want this for ninety dollars though. Oh, I want this so bad. I'm not gonna lie. I keep flipping it over because I want it so bad. Not for this price point, but I mean, it's totally worth it because where else can you get a Polynesian Resort shower curtain? And to be honest, it looks brand new. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Another steal of a deal. I feel like I should just grab these. Oh, I see that some of them have, well, this one has like a little, I wonder if I can just clean that off or if it's actually scratched. It's only five bucks. You can't even tell. Yeah, they got little scratches on it. But honestly, for $5, who cares? Like, you can't even see it. $5? You could take a little, like, white out. <laughs> no, put a white out. You could definitely fix that. Like, seriously, you could get, like, a little white marker and fix that. For five bucks? I'm, stu I'm stumbling. 
for five bucks. Yeah, that's a steal. I see some Disney Wish ornaments for only $7.99. That's a good deal too. Every time I come into this antique mall, it's so overwhelming because there's just so much stuffed in nooks and crannies all over this entire antique mall. These are all of the ornaments that were actually on the Disney trees. Such a great deal. They, let's see, priced as low as $2.50. $5, $7.50, they have Wilderness Lodge, Winterland, Summerland, Miniature Golf, Grand Floridian, three bucks, two fifty. dollars This was actually on their trees. Art of Animation, what else do we have? We have Boardwalk, Old Key West, did I say Brown Derby already? Animal Kingdom? I don't see any, is this, what is this? Oh, shut up. Gosh, this is cheaper than what it was in the outlets. The Paymax Countdown pen. Wasn't it? Wasn't it like $6.99 or $7.99 at the outlets? Yeah. This is only $4.99. Wow. There's, a, there's like just hiding over here in the corner. Oh, do I even want to look? They've got the bed. Look at this. 20 bucks for the bed runner. Oh, I don't want to look because I know I'm going to see some Polynesian stuff. Art of Animation, bed runner. $50. This is Saratoga Springs Treehouse Table Runner, $35. Caribbean Beach Shower Curtain with Hidden Bicky is $50. Animal Kingdom Lodge Bed Runner. Man, this looks brand new to me. From Kadani, $34.99. Oh, I like this because they have two of them. Oh my gosh, I'm so tempted to get that. Oh! struggle is real you guys this is oh fifty dollars the shower curtain from cars of art of animation caribbean beach club again this is from all-star resorts fifty dollars the shower curtain what is this one animal kingdom bed runner forty dollars oh i think we would have a blast if we came down here and did some do some shopping right who wants to do some live shopping let me know about some halloween horror nights this is the scarecrow stock mummy 695 dollars they've got so much amazing halloween goodness for your oh for your yard or your house if you want to decorate or if you're just a collector so for 75 dollars they have this awesome framed Jack art piece and Halloween Horror Nights 26. They have a few different pair of socks that you can get. $20. Ah! I'm the worst at picking things up. This one is $25 and the Screamers is $20 as well. Tons of glassware. Oh my goodness gracious. Look at, look at, look at. What do I show? We gotta do a live. Tell me, tell me right now. We have to do a live. Look at this guy. $950. Oh, he's scary. He's a scary one. <laughs> oh, there's so much to choose from. So much to choose from. Look at this. This is so cool. Why am I whispering? I don't need to be whispering. Look at this guy. I think he's been around for a while, huh? And maybe that guy. Oh, she's. <laughs> Hello, mate. <laughs> she kind of looked real, and he's been sitting there for so long that he got grass growing all over him. There's just something for everybody. If you want just a little bit of a collectible, look, dollar fifty vintage Disney three dollar pictures. How cool is that? Look at that MGM Studios. Look at these vintage Disney pictures. This is like a little treasure mine right here. And they've got like vintage magazines. Oh my gosh. Is this, oh, what is this one? Disneyland Resort, $3? Oh, that's so cool. They have this contemporary resort room, beautiful art piece for $125. I don't think I would like to ship that. If you missed my last video that I did here, I know it's been quite some time, but if you've ever been to Universal Studios, these are the actual props 
that was in the pre-show of the Shrek ride, which I think is just so stinking cool. It's so cool. And if you really don't like your neighbors, you could definitely scare the living crap out of them and put this in your front yard. Nice. I love it. Also, they have still the Shrek 3D glasses. Now, last time I came down here, they had a ton of them. And it looks like they've dimmed down a little bit. But this is a great way to just have a little piece of the ride for a memory. For $5, you can't go wrong. For $11.50 only, you can get a Disney Grand Floridian soap dish. Oh, it has this one has a little chip on it. Let's look at the other one and see how that one's made. That one looks like it's in has a little tiny chip at the bottom. But if you put it on the ground there, you can't even tell. They have some really cool Christmas props. These are from the Magic Kingdom Party. The dessert. Who's who's had the dessert fireworks to, like party thing? I have it. I want to do it. It looks good. But these are really great prices. The smaller reindeer are $9.99. The larger ones, they have this one and this one is just $25. $25 for this one. So $9.99, how much is the tree? The trees are 30. Those are cool, very cool. And then you have like the spiral trees. These are just $7.99. Oh, those are gorgeous. And then you have these down here. These little boxes are $7.99. It's no feasible way that you could get, look at this, look at this. There's no way you could capture all of the magic in one video there's just no way okay 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 here. we gotta stop and take a look at this don't we oh my goodness we we, we, de we definitely okay okay $14.99 we've got Phineas available I think that's the only one I see that's the popcorn bucket finding Dory is $4.99 all right what else do we have over here the Timon now the Timon zippers are looking kind of beat up they're 15. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought it said $10. So the Mickey 50th popcorn buckets are 20. Then you have, I think I showed this off in the beginning. No, 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 there's two different ones. Okay, so this is Casey Jr.'s popcorn bucket. Wow, that's a great deal. $8.49. Oh my God, I'm screaming right now. I couldn't even get this when I was in the parks. <gasps> and it's $20. I didn't, oh, they're so cute. These all look like they're, oh, well, that one's got a little crack in it. But they look, this one looks pretty good. Oh my goodness, they only have a couple of these. And then they have the Skyliner. How much is the Skyliner? Oh, it's missing its lid though. $15, I don't see the lid. If you want an authentic Disneyland construction hat, if your name is Kristen or Travis, oh, you got two Travises over here. They are about $345. Well, this one is actually $695 because it's from Shanghai Disney Resort. Boy, that's that's a collectible. I feel like I shouldn't even be touching it. Leave it to me to find the cheapest thing ever. Vintage Disney cast costumes. One dollar only. What? Uh, ooh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, it's a ba is it a bathing suit? It is a bathing suit. It's only a dollar? Yeah. Well, is it a bathing suit or was this part like underneath? I don't know. I mean, it definitely looks like a bathing suit, but it could be like a dance leotard for like one of the parades, right? Oh my gosh. Oh, <sighs> tripping over myself. Let's see here. Oh, these are cool. You could just, one dollar? Really? You can make it like a Halloween costume out of this, right? Pants. I don't know. I'm just saying. I feel like you could. Vintage cast member costume. One dollar. One dollar? Here they have more shower curtains and bed runners. What is what is this one? I'm curious to see what this I like the colors on this. So this one is from Port Orleans. Oh, the Royal Princess Room, and that's a shower curtain. It looks brand new. $55. So over here they have more of the soap dish trays for $12. And 
I also had the tissue holder for $12 along with the pass holder flower and garden mugs from 2020 and those are only $12. Take a moment and appreciate all of these vintage props up here. Wow. If you're planning to visit the Orlando area and you have a shopping day and you go to the Disney character warehouse or the outlets and you have a vehicle, come down here and check out this place for yourself. You will not be disappointed. There's just so much goodies. I could spend days down here creating videos, days, because there is so much goodness. Is this a Polynesian mirror? Oh my gosh, I need this in my life. It is, it's $95. Even with it being bent up, I would totally prop that in the corner of my room. Oh, I need this, I need it, I need it. I'm screaming, I need this. And there's some that are, look even better back there. Oh my gosh, I need this. Family, if you're watching, <laughs> yes, I will take one of these for Christmas or my birthday. <laughs> Kingdom Resort mirrors, and these are 125. And then they also have a Disney Yacht Club Resort chair for $2.95. If you have a pool, here you go. Get an authentic towel return. Some people want it. Disney Wilderness Lodge, $7.95. I mean, where else could you get this? Nowhere. Nowhere else. Disney MGM Studio sticker, $10. Man, I tell you what, this, they want $125 for this cup. And I know that some Starbucks cups really tend to go for a lot more. This is Disneyland Haunted Mansion. That's pretty cool. This must be worth some money, huh? If they're asking $125 for it. Wow, that's really nice. So in this bin of art, I don't see a price point in this, but I just think it's so cool. Look at this. This is so vintage. 15th birthday. Collector cans are here. 15 years. Wow. Ah, <sighs> I feel old. I do love how organized they have some of their artwork over here. They have all types of art and the cast member eyes and ears only $5. I, I just love how that's super organized. They have these framed tickets. Oh, that's a, so, that's a great idea. $25. For the frame tickets for B, twenty-five for C. Back in the day, I don't, I don't remember these. The whole set is one forty-five. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at these slides. These are so cool. You can kind of see them. Thirty dollars for these vintage slides. Let me tell you, if you're into artwork, they, this is the place to go. They just have tons and tons and tons of it. They also have quite a bit of the Walt. Disney World collection. Just look at all these boxes here. They have tons. $180. Tarzan. $110. Rex. I'm a jazz baby from Delivery Boy? What? The Delivery Boy Jazz Baby? $40? Bucks? Hmm. Jack Skellington. $235. Oh, so many to choose from. Oh, Peter Pan. This is only $20. Oh my gosh. So some of you that have shopped with me for a while, I know my people would love this. I know my people. $2.99 for this luggage tag. They got a couple of those in here. They've got different types of lanyards. I think this one's one of my favorite. I've caught holidays around the world. Oh, that's cute. How much is that? $2.50? See? Oh man, this is... Look at this one. 25th anniversary luggage tag. $2.99. I just want to give you an idea of how vast this particular area was. Once you follow my directions, it's this entire whole back side of the store. But then you also have this all back through here, all kinds of vendors, a lot more Disney, a lot of antique, a lot of vintage. I'm actually personally learning about a lot of vintage items myself and I'm here for it and I'm excited and I'm hoping to start a new series about that. I'm learning about different glassware, all kinds of things. Florida is definitely a plethora of amazing thrift finds and estate sales and yard sales and 
for Disney or any type of vintage goodness. Look at this. This is tons of mugs back here. Oh, look, another Haunted Mansion. Room for one more. This is pretty cool. How much is this? $18. That's cool. That's a good price point. Oh, look at the Disney California Adventure mug. That's super cool. $8. Oh, that's super cute. I love this. I'm going to turn around because I want you to see a couple other things over here is another uh, Disney vendor. And walking back here is another place where you want to keep your eyes open for vintage furniture and or more Disney props. I see more down there. So I'm going to walk back there slowly so you can kind of take in the ambiance so much to choose from. I'm gonna come over here. A lot of great antique pieces if you're just looking for something antique as well. You know what I find interesting is that they are asking $249 for this train. This train is currently in the outlets for $279. So they're actually cheaper than what you can get them at the outlets. But back here you have a ton of props. Oh my gosh. This is a size. Have I died and gone to heaven? I don't know. This is so. This is very overwhelming. Oh, Disney Cruise Line chairs. These are one o nine ninety nine a piece. This looks like it might be from Fort Wilderness. Look how cool. Let's see. Yep, Wilderness Lodge, seventy dollars. Both styles of chairs are just sixty nine ninety nine. This dude right here needs some. Needs a coffee. Needs some caffeine. Cheer up, buddy. So right down here on aisle I, I see some Disney stuff, some vintage items, some cool board games, but this of course caught my eye. You've got the 50th anniversary lounge fly for $67.99. You've got this, this is in the parks currently for $88, but look at this beauty for $94.99. And then you have the Snow White. Does it come with the wallet? I wonder. 125. Look at this lounge fly. Alice in Wonderland's Ace of Spades, $79.99. Nightmare Before Christmas Lounge Fly, $74.99. This freaking corner over here is a gold mine. These Stormtrooper helmets are $7.99. Yes, you heard me right, guys. $7.99. You've got these lightsabers over here for $1.99. These play sets are $4.99. Oh my gosh, and not the Affinity Stone. My son picks this up every time he goes. They don't have the stones in there, but they're $17.99. Untested, but $17.99. What? Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. They still have some of these. Oh, I can't remember the name of them. They're Star Wars sippers. Patty sipper. Those are $9.99. Oh my goodness. $32.99. I think these are like, I don't remember how much they are in parks. $100 maybe? They've got these Tron figurines. I feel like this is new. $30. I wonder if it's maybe they were the box was damaged or something. But $30. I think these were like $80 or something in the parks. Oh my gosh. How much is the Loki helmet? These are brand new. They were $50 normally. Oh my gosh. <gasps> $10 for a Loki helmet? Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't know how long I've been filming for. I feel like it's been for a very long time, but that is such a good deal. Okay, so let's talk about this. There is some really cool Polynesian. Oh, I love that. Tahitian Terrace. $195. They have some of these limited edition mugs that came from Trader Sam's. I know the glare is a little bad on here. Um, but those are $100 to $125, $125. If I zoom in, I can, oh, let me see if I can zoom in. Sorry, the sun is just, the glare is not the best. Uh, they've got the Haunted Mansion Gargoyle. I wonder if they have a box for this. $295. This was also from Trader Sam's. This is like the Trader Sam themed Polynesian resort glass. Oh, look at the 50th popcorn bucket in the corner there. $150. Ooh, if you want a Club 33 napkin, there you go. It can be yours for 
$15. I like that wallet over there. That Harvey's Disneyland wallet for $125. That's pretty cool. What is this? Fantasmic Club 33 years t-shirt. $295. With that being said, if you are a Club 33 member, you can definitely afford that price. This particular booth also has lots of just older collectibles which is really cool to see just so much goodness oh my gosh i can't take the excitement there's too much to look at but within the same booth is a classic attraction that has recently closed splash mountain so they actually have a lot of memorabilia currently for splash mountain and it's just something you cannot find I haven't even looked online to see what was available. Look at the Brer Rabbit patch. Now they have that price a little bit more affordably at $35. They have some of the tickets, framed tickets back here for $55. I see a Splash Mountain viewfinder for $30. There's a Splash Mountain pen for $45. These cool mugs, look at this. Dare to turn back. $60. Let's go to the ones that are just a little bit more higher price. Save a Splash Mountain notepad holder. This is $145. Then you have the log is the oh sorry. The log is the display only. So the plushes are $95 a piece. The have a zippity doody zip log bag is $12.95. There's a postcard back there for $35. A Splash Mountain team button, $65. Let's take a look at down here. You've got the Briar, let me zoom out. Briar Bear figure, $2.95. It says buy one of each. Rabbit, Fox, you get, so you get all three for $5.25. Burr Rabbit is $1.95 and Burr Box is $2.65. Everything is satisfactual. Pen is $45. Right behind that you have a Mickey pen for $50. You also have the Grand Opening Splash Mountain Watch for $2.65. You have a Splash Mountain Button for $30. I see a cast member that one right there is a cast member button for $195. There's a Disneyland button. Let me see if we can zoom in just a pinch on that one is $30. The plate is $60. And coming down here, there's even a few more pens. So the pens are $45 and $50, which isn't bad, right? Weren't they going for like $200 at one point? I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Then you have this frame, which is 125. This is a cool frame. So they have two. They have one that's Walt Disney World, and the other one is Walt is I almost said Walt Disneyland. <laughs> Disneyland, the Disneyland version. Then you have the Kingdom Press photo, 1992. That is 65. I would imagine that they would have a box to go with this. I definitely would not ship this. It says, as is, $3,295. I've never seen this before in my life. And this is definitely, oh my goodness, this is definitely some artwork right here. Look at this. Wow. I wonder if it does anything. Was it a water fountain? I don't know. And they also have a Splash Mountain framed Splashtacular Grand Opening 1992. And that is $295. It's, wow, they certainly do have quite a collection. A bunch of really cool framed artwork back here, including two different Splash Mountain. I think they're like little posters, maybe. Look at this one. Celebrating 25 years, Disneyland annual passport. $50, not a bad price point, right? I don't think it's a bad price point, 50 bucks. Look at this booth. They've got tons of pop figures. Oh my goodness. Even more collectibles. The store is about to close. I've been here almost two hours now, but look at Oswald. Oh my gosh, he's 425. <gasps>
my son would die. Ah, oh, look at this Lion King totem pole for $300. I don't think I've ever seen anything quite so, so unique. That's amazing. I love that. Goofy, wake up. Someone's trying to call you. How cool is that? Alright guys, I'm going to leave you with Melly's Remarket because they have some of the most gorgeous art pieces that I've ever seen. Oh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous! Enchanted Tiki Room, the blueprints for the castle, you've got Mickey, look at this jukebox, oh my gosh, and the winner of it all, this welcome foolish mortals to the haunted mansion, look at that! This is like a desk that's been repurposed. What? This is, this is, as my brother would say, this is sick. <laughs> well, I officially closed the place down. <laughs> oh man, I could have spent all day. I'm going to have to make this an all day event because I am totally into vintage items, not just Disney anymore, but I am loving retro vintage. I've been learning about certain pieces uh, over the last couple years and this place is just a gold mine all together. Love to look at this place. Great for decor, great for anything, not just Disney. So uh, anyhow, give me a like if you are interested in my personal shopping services. You can shoot me an email to see how I work. I primarily pick up around the Disney parks area and the Disney outlets and that's shopping with character at gmail.com if you don't want to miss out on any of my adventures hit that like button and subscribe and the bell notification to upload you of upload you oh my goodness I need coffee after this <laughs> I'm still so excited hit the bell button in order to be notified of all my future adventures anyways until next time don't forget every day is a gift so have faith and share the joy all right, this is just a little bonus clip. If you guys spend the day thrifting or going to the Antique Lakeland Mall, check out the Silver Moon Theater. It is a old school drive-in movie theater. And tonight I'm super excited. I'm at my family down here and we're gonna watch a double feature of the new movie, Elemental, which just got released and the live action Little Mermaid, which I've already seen once, but it's so good, I will watch it again.